Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. Today we are having a pair of problems from Math Olympiad preparation. Question number one is from radical expressions. We have to simplify square root 13 plus 6 times square root 3 plus 2 root 2. And second question is from exponential equations. It is x power x power 2024 equal to 2024. So let's begin this video with our very first mathematical challenge from nested equation e equal to and I will begin with this radicand term. So let me write our expression as 13 plus 6 times square root. Now I can see 3 can be written as 2 plus 1. Let's write. So it will become 2 root 2. Okay, now I will write a square root 13 plus 6 times square root. Can we write 2 as root 2 whole square? 1 as 1 whole square? And 2 root 2 as 2 times root 2 times 1. Now if you will see, this is a square plus b square plus 2a b. So in this place, we can write it as one perfect square, a plus b whole square formula, where a is root 2 and b is 1. So this complete radicand I will replace with root 2 plus 1 whole square. Let's replace. So 13 plus 6 times square root, root 2 plus 1 whole square. Now we can cancel a square with this square root. So what is left? It is a square root 13 plus 6 times square root 2 plus 1. Let's expand. So I will write 13 plus 6 root 2. 13 plus 6 root 2 plus 6. Further we can simplify. 13 plus 6 is 19. So 19 plus 6 square root 2. Now it is more simplified in form. Let us do the same practice. I will write E equal to square root 19 plus 6 root 2. Now I will split 19 as 18 plus 1. So I can write it is 18 plus 1 plus 6 square root 2. Again we can write 18 as root 18 whole square. 1 as 1 square. And if I will write here as per formula then 2 root 18 times 1. And we know that root 18 is 3 root 2. How it is? 9 times 2. It is 3 root 2. So we can see this 6 as 2 times 3 root 2. So it is 2 root 18. We can write 2 times 3 root 2 times 1. Again it is matching with a square plus b square plus 2ab. So we can write here, it is a square root of a square root 18 plus 1 whole square. Now a square root sign and a square will be cancelled out. So I will cancel these two. What is left? That is our simplified answer. Root 18 plus 1. This is how we will solve any nested radical problem. Let us consider question number 2. Here I will begin with our substitution. It is this power. So let me consider, let us consider x power 2024 equal to 2, I will consider a. Now this power part is a. What about this base? I need to convert x value in terms of a. How it would be? I will raise both sides. Power 1 over 2024. 
it is 2024 equal to a our substitution now raise both sides power 1 over 2024 to this side also now i will write one exponent property a power b whole power is c then we can write any time a power b times c so these two powers i will cancel 2024 and the reciprocal of 2024 so i will write x is equal to a power 1 over 2024 this is our x and this is our power exponent here so replace both exponent and base by the number or variable a so let me write here i will write a power 1 over 2024 and then i will be writing our power x power 2024 as a equal to 2024 now second exponent property which we can use it is swapping in power a power b whole power c we can write a power c whole power b we will swap these two so let's swap both the powers here also so i will write a power a whole power is 1 over 2024 and right hand side it would be 2024 Again, we will take power 2024 both sides. So let me write here a power a whole power is 1 over 2024 and right hand side is 2024. Raise both sides power 2024. So we will write like this 2024 2024. Now using exponent property, we will cancel these two numbers. What is left? A power A equal to 2024 power is 2024. So our conclusion A equal to 2024. Now let us put the value of our substitution A. It was x power 2024 this was our substitution a so here i will be writing x power 2024 equal to 2024 now i will take 2024th root both sides 2024 here also 2024 so this 2024 power with 2024th root it will be over so what i will be getting my answer x is equal to 2024th root of 2024 this is our final answer now question arises is this the only solution possible so i will draw one graph of our function which is in left hand side it would be like this so if you will check its y intercept value this value is 1 and see our right hand side of the equation is 2024 so it would be somewhere here for example suppose i am taking this is 2024 on y axis so there will be only single intersection possible as you can see once you will draw one straight line 2024 so that is why only single solution is possible for real values i hope this video will be meaningful to you do not forget to like share and subscribe bye bye till next video friends good luck and take care of yourself bye bye